Michigan's Attorney General has some choice words for former Governor John Engler. She is upset that Governor Engler hasn't been available for an interview with her and, and her investigators. They want to know more about the Nassar scandal at Michigan State University. We bring in Mara McDonald, who's live downtown tonight. Mara, Engler now says he will not sit for an interview unless the assistant AG who's been handling the case recuses them herself. Ex Himself. Yeah, Devin, that's yep. where we're at tonight. And what we're looking at is a, at times a pretty tense email chain between that assistant AG and Angler's attorney. And tonight each side is looking at the other saying you're the problem. What was supposed to be a no big deal voluntary interview between Engler and the AG's office is now elevated to a flame war between the sides. In a scathing letter from Engler's attorney, it makes it clear they have no use for the assistant AG, Christina Grassi. Quote, what has become clear is the ethical standards and objectivity required for the conduct of an investigation are inapplicable to your approach to Mr. Engler. On the phone tonight, the AG herself says, that's nonsense. We've been trying for a very long time to have John Engler interviewed, and he's been dodging us at every turn. A deal had been struck earlier in March for an AG investigator to fly to D.C. to interview Engler because he would not be in Michigan. So you can imagine our surprise when we saw photographs of him at these MSU basketball games. That ignited a he said, she said between the sides with a long email chain back and forth about when, where, and the scope of the interview. After seeing those pics, the AG's office canceled Engler's DC interview next week. Engler's attorney firing back, quote, your conduct diverges so drastically from the most basic principles of fairness, justice, and what is right that you have undermined the integrity of your own investigation. Nestle, is backing her people tonight. I think that the emails speak for themselves. Um, you know, Christina and all friends acted completely professionally. Um, and, you know, her frustration is clear after it uh, became clear to us that um, Engler and his attorney had, um, you know, been deceptive with us. Back here live. So right now, no interview scheduled with the AG's office and former governor and interim president at MSU, John Engler. Is that going to change? Well, we'll see. If you want to see exactly what that back and forth looked like, we're going to throw it all up on clickondetroit.com. We're live downtown tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. Yeah, worth a look. All right, Mara.